I've been in a contest for a number of years. I've been in the Iowa Masters, which they don't have anymore. I've won that 11 times over the years. Now we're in the National Corn Growers and been in it the last eight years. Won seven out of the last eight years. Set a new world record three times. And the world record right now that I set in 2002 of uh, 442 bushels the acre. And even on my, all my acres, we use Conklin products. We use the Wax, we use the uh, Rainfast, we use the uh, Amplify D, uh, Guardian, all their products. Even have some of the lube products that we're using and uh, having real good luck. I guess what I'd say, the bottom line to the Conklin products, what I have seen and known of the company, they don't have any out there. If it isn't a real good product, they just simply won't sell it. All their products are really good. I think that using these products so far this year, the first time, I've my corn looks better than it ever has. I uh, raised dairy heifers, and with that, um, about 250 acres of corn and beans, and also have a full-time job about two and a half hours away from this farming operation. And uh, again, I can't stress how good my corn looks uh, this year. A corn and soybeans, grain sorghum, and, and winter wheat. Uh, what I tried first uh, in the Conklin was what uh, amplified the uh, seed treatment for corn. We no-till every acre, have been no-till for years. The challenge of no-till corn is getting it up and going early. The soils are cold and wet, and it's a planter box treatment. We tried it uh, first year and saw tremendous results in the emergence of those plants. Um, we used uh, a test. Our test was 10 kernels of corn with and without early April. The Amplified D, all of those plants came up. The other plants laid there and rotted without it. That's, that was our test. I mean, so we use it on all of our corn. It's uh, great on emergence. Generally, you'll get somewhere around 1,500 more plant population up to 2,500. You're looking at five to eight bushel increase in the yields. And on, uh, we use it on grain sorghum and corn. We're using uh, these products mostly because they work for us. It's not something we do just to try. We're getting very good results from them. And in uh, the end, it's uh, making us money. As we travel throughout the Corn Belt working the major shows, the Husker Harvest Days, the Farm Progress Show, the NCGA Commodity Classic Show, we find out one theme that farmers are looking for. How do I simultaneously decrease my input cost and increase my yields? And that is truly what the AgriVantage system is all about. Targeting those factors to make sure that we're getting the most return on investment for every nutrient dollar spent. I would encourage you to grab a soil test and find out how to best spend your nutrient dollars and increase your profit margin.